I'm here at the Seattle Aquarium and we're going to go ahead and go inside and see what they have there. I got the Seattle City Pass so it's usually easier to get in and it's a lot cheaper. You save about half price on everything. So it's well worth getting. Anyway, let's go ahead and check it out. This aquarium is huge. Probably about 14 feet high. Well, here come some more waves. Looks like they have a wave making machine for this. I think this is supposed to simulate a tide pool. Check out the jellyfish. Part of this door here. These rooms are made up with sea stuff. Pretty, pretty big fish in here. It's like baby sharks or something right there. This is the coral nursery. Wow, it's got little shells are growing these things on. We got this cool little place outside here. Got kind of a little step system set up for get some of the fish going out to sea maybe. I came right up to the edge. Orca whale skeleton. That must be part of the head, I'm thinking. It's a pretty cool room. There's a shark up there. <laughs> so we have green sea anemones in here. Got some birds hanging out here. This might be the one that the other one was calling. This bird ain't listening. <laughs> Got this otter bench. But you never seen one of those before. One big ocean. Yeah, population of Puget Sound. Check that out. I'm well aware of that. We created an artificial waterfall here. Well, I finished the Seattle Aquarium and it was pretty interesting. They used to have a whale exhibit where I think they had uh, 
Shamu or something in there. Anyway, they don't have that anymore, but it's still a lot of interesting things to see. Well worth it. I'm about to go on to the Great Seattle Wheel, so let's check that out too. There's the Seattle Wheel. That's where we're heading to right now. Selling clothes here. There it is. I can't believe they built this just for me. This is great. I'm not worried. I got lucky number 13. And they changed me to number 12. At least I'm in here with all my friends. I'm not one to look down on people, but for some reason, I just can't help it. And here we go. Again. That's our football and baseball stadium over there. St. Cofield and ah, I can't think of the other one right now. I've never been to either one of them. Oh wait, I did go to St. Cofield once. There's Mount Rainier. And there's the Seattle Aquarium. It's the Seattle Aquarium where we just were. I think that's an Argosy cruise boat, which I will be taking in a couple of days. Little parking lot. Some of the other piers. Fisherman's Restaurant and Bar. Here's the Seattle City Skyline. That noise in the background is the air conditioning that turned on. You can see we're quite a ways up here. I think this is our last go round as he said, it's three times. And this is our third time, so we'll probably be getting off here. Hey, they said three times. I'm going around for the fourth time. What's going on? Good thing my wife isn't here. She's afraid of heights. We went on a Ferris wheel once and she was terrified. Yeah, she was pretty scared, afraid to look out the window. The floor has a little football sticker on the bottom of it. I would show our local Seattle football team's logo, but I don't want to get sued for using it without their permission. Yeah, you can tell this is a port city. Lots of ships come in here. All the way up at the top. The size of that ship. Yeah, I'm up at the top and the gondola's rocking a little bit. Yeah, my wife would be really scared right now because we're up really high. Oh well. And I think this is where we're going to be getting off. Ah, we're back here again. Back at the carousel. Which I have yet to see running. Shooting gallery, giant gumball machine. All the heads. Some old 
pictures. There's people mining up in the Alaskan Klondike. Oh my goodness, they wore a mask even back then. Pirates plunder imports. This must be the guy that plundered everything. So I don't know how he could run away with that jelly belly. Maybe this is the real guy that did it. Looks like we got a loading dock here. Yeah, this is moving around. I feel like I'm a drunk person. But it gets too close to the edge, you can fall in. Check out the way this goes back and forth. They don't have any rails here, which surprises me. I can't believe people haven't fallen in. Look at how much it moves up and down. A little ladder you can climb up. In case you fall in. I'm going back up here. It's hard to stand up straight on that dock. This is the Pier 62 Park. It's owned by the city, city of Seattle. Almost said silly. Wouldn't want to do that. a good shot of the skyline here. I'd like to thank you for joining me today and hope you'll come back and join me again for another adventure of Big A.